So our King F8 irons for 2018 continues to give consumers the choice between a variable length set and a one length set. Both our one length and variable length F8 irons feature some key technologies. We have a variable face thickness on the iron this year, which will give us increased ball speed from all over the club face. So our F8 irons also feature tech flow technology. So the four, the five, the six, and the seven iron comes with a full hollow. The eight, the nine, and the pitching wedge comes with a cavity back finish. And then we have a speciality finish in the gap wedge, sand wedge, and lob wedge. Both our one length and variable length F8 irons come with Cobra Connect fully integrated and embedded into the grip. 2018 sees the evolution of the relationship between Cobra and Arcos that will now result in Cobra Connect. So from next year, every Cobra club that is sold will have embedded sensors in all their clubs. So this will allow the user to not only track their round as they play, but really allow them to understand their strengths and weaknesses. So when they go out on the course, they'll be able to collect all their stats and data, and then using our proprietary algorithms, they'll be able to understand how to go out and practice and improve faster than all their peer group. So we're back in London after our little trip to Paris to play golf national with Cobra. And we've been testing out the new Cobra King F8 irons. We hit these for the first time a few months ago at the London launch at M1 Golf in Canary Wharf. So we've got a bunch of experience putting this both on the range and also out on the course and seeing how it performs in a real game situation. So the first big thing to say about this, as you've just heard from Andrew and Joe, is that there's going to be Cobra Connect powered by Arcos for the first time in these irons. That's going to allow you to really drill down on your iron stats and see how far you're hitting each club, your gapping, um, your, how accurate you are, greens and regulation, all those kind of things. It's going to let you see quickly and easily where you're falling apart in your iron game or conversely, unlike me, where you're playing really well with your irons. So in seconds, you'll really easily be able to see where you can improve in your iron play, which hopefully, of course, will help you play better golf. So you have the PowerShell face, which is designed to offer you more distance. And we can say that, like the F8 drivers, yes, the F8 irons are longer than the F7 irons. We're getting more ball speed, more distance, but perhaps the thing that impressed us the most was we were getting better consistency from these irons. Our gapping was really set, um, which is, for better players, really important. So you've got the distance there, which lots of players require, but you've also got that gapping, which is going to mean that as you do hopefully become better at golf, you're still going to be able to use these irons and play really, really good golf. So the progressive tech through the set of irons makes a lot of sense. Having the cavity and the grooves that offer you lower spin in the long irons, it just makes a whole load of sense. Um, on those long irons, you're going to be wanting distance and you're also going to be wanting a lot of forgiveness, which is why they put that tech in one. On the shorter irons, you're going to be wanting control, you're going to be able to work the ball flight, those kind of things. Um, we definitely found that this actually really helped us um, in our control across the set. There was a definite increase in forgiveness with that big cavity in the long irons and we felt like we could really work those shorter irons and we were in complete control of what we were doing with the golf ball. The feel has really improved for 2018. There's a bunch of carbon being uh, carbon fiber being used in these irons, which is going to give you a slightly, we had a slightly maybe firmer feel this this year. Um, that's not to say it wasn't nice. It was really nice. It was firm, um, but really responsive. We felt like we knew exactly what was happening on every shot, and that we could have a lot more control over our shots because of that um, increased response. The looks of the irons. Um, we think Cobra have kind of really sensibly gone, right, this is a game improvement iron. They're not trying to make it look like a player's iron. They've gone, right, this is a game improvement iron. It's got a mid to thick top line in the sole. It's not too chunky, but they're not kind of trying to hide the chunkiness. They're like, okay, this is it. It looks pretty cool, sat behind the ball. that has the cool graphics on the back and stuff. And overall, it's a decent looking, um, it's a decent looking iron that we think most players will be happy to play. Of course, you're going to be able to play the one length set of the King F8 irons 
for 2018, there are some there are some uh, small small kind of improvements to this. If you're familiar with it, it's basically a set of irons all of one length uh, length and also swing weight. So it's just like hitting a seven iron with every shot. You don't have to change anything. So it makes the game a lot simpler. If you're a one length fan from the last year, you're definitely going to be a big fan of what they've done to this year's iron. It's basically the same improvement in terms of feel, distance that you're going to get from the variable length putting to a one length set. So it makes sense if you were fans of the F7 one length, you're going to love the F8 for this year. There's also a one length hybrid, which some of the Cobra guys are calling the Wombrid. This is a super funky, I mean it's totally mental, but it's pretty cool. It's, it feels totally mad when you line up with it for the first few strikes. It's going to take you a while, but if you are playing that one length set, it makes sense that why would you want to play the one next set and then have to set up completely different to hit your hybrid. Yeah. If you want to also have your entire set of irons at one length and then throw in your hybrid as well at that seven, end, uh, at that seven iron length, then this is the club that you want to also put in there. So these irons in both the variable length and the one length set are going to cost you 649 for seven pieces, £100 more if you want it with graphite shafts. It's, a, it's definitely a club that we think you should be considering for 2018. Very much like the driver, this is a really, really good product at a competitive price that we want everyone to go out and see how they play with it because Cobra, I think possibly their biggest challenge in 2018 is going to be getting their stuff tested by golfers. Golfers are often very loyal to a brand. We suggest that you go out and actually test every single product out there when you're deciding to buy something. Don't go in there with your mind made up and say, hey, I want to get this brand or this club. Go in, have a test of everything, see what suits you, and also, of course, suit your budget. Please let us know what you think of the new irons by commenting on this video below. Head to our social media feeds on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And of course, thanks for watching.